Hi, my name is Joey Papa. I'm a coffee consultant, and today we're going to learn how to make espresso with cream and milk. Now, espresso is concentrated coffee that you can enjoy in many forms. A lot of people drink espresso just straight up, just the way that it is, black and strong. Other people like to top it off with a little steamed milk or steamed cream or half and half, and that's called a cafe macchiato. And macchiato just basically means to mark or to stain something. So in essence, you're staining your espresso shot with a little steamed half and half or milk. Or you could also drink it in a cappuccino form. Cappuccino basically has a shot of espresso in the bottom, a little hot milk, and then the rest of the beverage is a bunch of foam from the milk. Now, a lot of people enjoy these, and you can add, you can add sugar to them and make a great cappuccino. Or you can enjoy a cafe latte. Cafe latte is similar, but it has a lot more milk and less foam. It's a shot of espresso. The rest of the beverage is pretty much all steamed milk, and then it's just topped off with about one inch of foam on top of a latte. So choose which one and how you want to enjoy your espresso with cream or milk, and then go from there. What you're going to need in order to do this is an espresso machine. You're going to need some finely ground espresso, which you could buy pre-ground at your grocery store, and you're going to need some milk or cream of your choice. First step is you're going to take your portafilter out of your espresso machine, and you're going to fill it with finely ground espresso. Once it's filled with that espresso, you're going to take your pinky finger, go across the top to make a smooth and even surface, and then you're going to take your tamper. You're going to apply 40 pounds of pressure to the espresso that's in the portafilter, and you want to apply that evenly so that you come out with a very smooth and even surface. Return the portafilter to your espresso machine and turn your espresso machine on. Keep an eye on the color of the espresso as it comes out of the machine. As it turns a yellowish orange color, you're then going to want to go ahead and stop pouring that shot. In the meanwhile, you can also get your milk ready. You're going to put your milk in a carafe and you're going to steam it in your steam wand. Put the steam wand in the carafe with the milk and turn the steam wand on high. You're going to scratch the surface for about two to three seconds and then you're going to submerge the steam wand back into the milk until you hear a rumbling sound or until the carafe becomes too hot to touch. After it's too hot to touch, you're going to turn your steam wand off and you're done making your steamed milk. Once you have your, your steamed milk and your shot of espresso, you're then going to pour your espresso into your serving cup and then you're going to pour your steamed milk on top of your espresso. Again, there are tons of varieties and ways of making espresso with milk or cream. You just got to uh, get creative and taste a whole bunch of different ways and discover which one you like the best. Again, my name is Joey Papa. I'm a coffee consultant. And today we learned how to serve espresso with milk or cream.